Columbia Houston, good morning to the blue team. That was fake plastic trees for Willie. Thanks, Stephanie. Radiohead's my favorite group. Thanks to my lovely wife, Lonnie, and my three handsome boys, Sean, Christopher, and Cameron. I was a little late in responding because I had a razor in my hand and I was shaving in front of the mirror. This is Mission Control Houston now with live video inside the Space Hab Research Double Module, which is serving as the laboratory for the crew members aboard the Space Shuttle Columbia now. Payload Commander Mike Anderson is now working with the laminar soot processes experiment that is located in a combustion module. The laminar soot processes experiment has been commanded through several burn sessions inside this combustion module. Scientists are taking advantage of the microgravity environment in low Earth orbit to slow down the process of the flame reactions so that they can study them better and better understand the formation of the soot in the flame. We're now looking at video of the mechanics of granular materials experiment and the space hub of the research double module in the payload bay of the space And that flame behaves, behaves uh, very differently in microgravity than it does here on Earth. All the processes inside that flame occur much more slowly than they do on Earth, and that gives researchers a better chance to understand uh, how the flame burns and how it produces soot. That music was for Laurel, Amazing Grace, by the Black Watch and the band of 51 Highland Brigade. It's great to wake up to the uh, sound of the pipes and inspirational music. That song brings back many wonderful memories for me and added on another one today. My husband and I got engaged in Scotland and uh, I send my love to my husband John and to my son Ian who has a name originating in Scotland. 
appreciate working with all you guys, and we're looking forward to a great day, too. This is Mission Control Houston. We're back with live coverage of the STS-107 Science Mission of Columbia. We're getting live downlink on NASA television. This is coming to us uh, from the MEDEX experiment, the Mediterranean Israeli Dust Experiment. That uh, experiment is mounted on a pallet uh, just behind the SpaceHab double research module in Columbia's cargo bay and includes two cameras. We're seeing an image of the moon from one of those cameras, the almost full moon, during this data take. This is Mission Control Houston, continuing to watch video switch between the six international student payloads aboard the Space Shuttle Columbia. The Space Technology and Research Students payload is located in a shuttle mid-deck locker inside the Space Hub module. It includes the international educational payloads that students from six different countries developed. This live video now coming from inside one of the experiments aboard Base Shuttle Columbia. This is the facility for absorption and surface tension, which is studying the response of sur surface tension to carefully controlled changes in the surface area of the bubbles or droplets. You can see in this view a bubble or droplet is formed at the end of the tube. We're seeing live downlink from Colombia as the orbiter is just about to cross the east coast of Africa. These are shots from a payload bay camera coming down uh, digitally. And we're seeing a cloud-covered Straits of Mombasa just below us uh, with the orbiter on a course that will take it over the northern tip of the island of Madagascar. <laughs> 